Tonight, Fresno Police Chief Jerry Dyer is still trying to deal with the loss of a former colleague and a friend. Former Fresno Police Captain Marty West was shot and killed by police officers yesterday. Police say he was suicidal and charged at them with a knife. CBS 47's Pedro Quintana sat down with the chief and talked about how officers deal with mental health calls. Pedro. Ken, Chief Dyer says his officer involved shooting caught everyone in the police department off guard. Dyer also telling me he recently learned West's family sought help for West after he started showing signs of mental illness three months ago. It was uh, very emotional for me yesterday and uh, it was very emotional for many of our officers. Fresno Police Chief Jerry Dyer still coping with the loss of his friend and colleague, 63-year-old Marty West. West, a former police captain who worked through the ranks and retired in 2007, then taking on the position of chief of police in the city of Oakdale. Monday morning, officers arrived at West's home after getting a call from his wife, telling dispatch her husband was trying to take his own life. When officers arrived to the home, West allegedly charged at the officers with a large knife, forcing officers to open fire. The main thing for me as a police chief yesterday after watching that video was to go give that officer a hug, both of those officers, and tell them they did what they had to do to keep themselves alive. Dyer tells me 300 police officers have gone through a crisis intervention training to deal with mental health calls. The department has several resources for officers who are involved in a shooting. When I read this, Fresno County Sheriff's Lieutenant Brent Stalker teaches at the police academy at Fresno City College. He says part of his teaching is giving officers the tools on dealing with mental health situations while out in the field. I try to teach that when you get on scene that sometimes the best thing you can do is communicate. But again, the person has to be willing on the other end to accept that communication. And Chief Dyer tells me this is the seventh officer involved shooting in the city of Fresno. For now, we're live in control room. Pedro Quintana, CBS 47 Eyewitness News. Pedro, thank you.